Hello everybody and welcome to Baldur's Gate 3. Oh my god, it's finally here. I am so excited. I'm not wasting any time. Let's just jump in. I'm going to be playing on balanced here. Oh man. I've been waiting for this for a long time, dude. <laughs> Who am I indeed? Let us find out. Ooh. Random, 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 random. Epic. <laughs> God, what a creature. Okay. Uh, so we're going to be playing as the Dark Urge. Ooh. Let's play the introduction. I haven't seen any of these, actually. My ruined body yearns to reap death in this world. And when this foul urge calls, it possesses my whole being. Injured, beyond repair. I know nothing besides this. I must resist the dark urge, lest it consume my mind. I must discover who I was and what happened to me. Before my twitching knife hand writes a tragedy in blood. Oh, that's fucking cool, dude. Do all of them have intros? Oh, fuck. We're watching all the intros for sure. I haven't seen any of these. I gotta fucking watch them. promise not to bite until we've been formally introduced. My name's Astarian, and I've spent a century stalking the night, hunting for pretty morsels just like you. A man called Cazador made me what I am, kept me like a pet, forced me to do his bidding. No more. The Tadpole's influence broke his dominance over me, and now I can finally pursue the one thing I've hungered for these long, dark years. Revenge. I'm going back to Baldur's Gate to track Cazador down in his lair. I'll be the last thing the bastard ever sees. <laughs> Wow, okay. So that's way more than I've known about. 
So this is going to give their whole backstory and shit, too. These are all your party members, by the way. You can play as any of them. If you wanted. But we're going to be creating our own character. For sure. Since I was born in the cold reaches of world space, I have known but one purpose. To wield a silver sword and ride a red dragon in service of my regent, the Githyanki Queen Vlakin. My first step on this path is to slay a Mind Flayer and bring its head to my queen. There is no flesh I will not carve, and no barrier I will not shatter to see it done. I am the one who sunders. I am the Undying Queen's most unshakable warrior. I am Lazelle of Kalir. Okay. Very straightforward with her. Gail? What's your story, bud? Well met, stranger. You find yourself in the presence of the renowned wizarding prodigy, Gale of Waterdeep. Please, no need to be intimidated. My virtuosic talents once caught the eye of the goddess of magic herself, Mistra, who named me her chosen and her lover. Thanks to a slight miscalculation on my part, that relationship eventually soured, as did the greatest of my powers. Now I'm merely a humble wizard on the road to redemption. Unless I can find the path to something greater. Interesting. Okay. He's looking for power. Shadowheart? My name is Shadowheart, loyal servant of Shah, goddess of darkness and loss. There is little more I can tell you than that. My lady Shah tasked me with a mission of such secrecy that I surrendered great swathes of my memory in order to safeguard the knowledge of it. All I know is that I must bring the artifact I hold to Baldur's Gate, and that nothing can stand in my way. My goddess is watching very mysterious Ooh, i like it she's definitely gonna be uh part of our party uh asterion is also probably gonna be in our party i haven't decided on who else maybe will maybe gail but we'll see Seven years ago, I was exiled from Baldur's Gate, the city I call home. My name is Will, but the people of the Sword Coast call me the Blade of Frontiers, champion of the meek, defender of the innocent. The truth isn't quite so simple, but they're right about one thing. I hunt monsters, and I always catch my prey. My latest target is a devil, and I'm right on her tail. Once I'm through with her, she'll never escape the fires of the first hell. Okay. Pretty, uh, straightforward there. Now, her I have never even seen. So, let's find out. Ago, I was sold to the Archdevil Zariel. She put a hellfire engine in my chest and made me her prized soldier. But I've escaped now. Thank you, Mind Flayers. And I've got a few scores to settle. If this engine doesn't burn me to ash first, I'll need people I can trust. An infernal mechanic and a serious amount of luck. But you know what? I'm not worried. After ten years in the Hells, I can take on anything. I've got my chance at freedom. And believe me, I'm going home. Very cool. I like her. She's got an infernal engine in her chest cavity. 
Dang. Okay. So we're going to be playing a half elf. Uh, we're going to be doing a wood elf for the movement speed. And then we're going to be playing a paladin. Ooh, fun. I really like the paladin in this game. It's super good. Uh, we're going to be taking the oath of devotion, but this really isn't going to matter because we're going oath breaker, baby. Which is... Oh, background, the hunted one. Oh, medicine and intimidation. I will take that. Cool. And then I'm going to even out my charisma and my strength here. And then I, uh, we're definitely going to take persuasion. Athletics, I think, is fine because we're going to be shoving people around and shit. I think that's good. Let's edit our appearance here. Give me one second. All right. I think that's our boy. Our boy. Our dude, bro. He's going to be such an asshole. <laughs> he just looks like a Chad. Let's keep going. The Dark Urge. That's the character name. No, thank you. We are going with... Zanros. That sounds cool. Fucking name generator. Anyway, we need a guardian. All right, dude, check this out. Hell yeah, there we go. Goth Bay of my dreams. Oof. Venture forth.
Damn, that opening cutscene so fucking good. Just looks beautiful. Oh, there I am. Sleepy boy. You're needed, Master Chief. I'm covered in viscera. What the hell? I haven't even done anything yet, dude. The blood in your head thrums and pounds. That pounding blood obscures who you are. An overwhelming loss of memory. How you ended up amidst these hellish flames is just as hidden. You have nothing in your skull. Besides your name and a headache. But you are in danger. Okay, fair enough. Thank you, lady. Um, Curse whoever did this. Say your name aloud. You have a part of yourself. Take a deep breath, shake your head, and start anew. Time to get out of here. And then you can shed light on the dark of the matter of yourself. All right, we're in it, dude. It's here, bro. So I'm going to I've played this opening both in early access and the actual game so many fucking times, but I'm not going to metagame it. Uh, I think there's like two things that I'm going to really metagame game. But other than that, I'm going to play it pretty straight this is the like this. Investigation. Negative one. I got it. Fuck. Well. Good, good start. Always the first roll is so good. Reach towards it. Okay. That's weird. It's supposed to hit me, but... I'm too strong, even for you, sir. Dead. Lamal. I know there's two chests in here. There's one over there. But this opening is just so good now. Because, um... Uh, it used to be a lot longer in the, uh... In the early access, but... They really slimmed it down, and... It looks really good. Ooh. Actually, I want that. Give me that. Now you can. How many die today? How many die? Today? Fourteen gold, not bad. Actually, you know what? We're just gonna jump that. Yeet! Because this thing fully heals you. I feel. Schwinker. Yep. In we go. Hello, hello. Anything of use? Goblin. A little bit of gold. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Doesn't look like there's anything interesting around. Let's go talk to the brain. I'm coming. I saw it, dude. I feel like that sometimes, dude. 
I get you. Yes, you've come to save us from this place. From this place, you'll free us. The exposed brain quivers in expectation. Please, before they return, they return. Who am I talking to? A man or a brain? To an intellect of yeah, a minion of the mind I passed it. Who abducted you. I think you're past the point of saving. Tell me what to do. Remove us from this body, from this case. Free us, please. Uh, I have plenty of strength, right? Plus three, plus one, yeah. Let's go! Let's do it! Ayo! 16, baby! Good shit. And smack it! <laughs> the brain lifts from the skull. But you notice an opportunity. You could cripple the strange creature, making it more subservient, should it prove a threat. Your fingers twitch with the desire to rip its tender, moist meat oh. to shreds. Okay. I get a plus one for dex. Let's do it. Split splatter. I get advantage on this? Okay. Oh, perfect. Holy shit. Beautiful. Oh. The creature seems unaware of your interference. It relaxes in your hands. Oh, good boy. Whoop. And then it grows 20 times its size. Our freedom is ours, friend. The creature pauses, listening. Something behind your eyes seizes in recognition. We must go to the helm. At the helm, we are needed. Uh, what's at the helm? Tenses, as though querying an unseen advisor. Do you not hear it? We will not survive here. We are needed to navigate. We are needed to leave this realm. Um, what should I call you? Us. We are us. Oh. Okay. Uh, all right, let's go. We are going to the helm. Okay. Cool. Got ourselves a little friend. Creature reaches into your mind, its thoughts rattling against yours. Something inside you squirms in recognition. Friend, we will go to the helm now. Okay. <laughs> uh, was I forced onto this ship? I wanted you to stay behind. Something was put in my eye. What is it? Uh, I was forced. Why was I forced on this ship? To love you. To give you our gift. Damn, okay. Uh, something was put in my eye. What was it? A gift. A gift to make you as we are. Soon you will be so beautiful. So powerful. Can you tell me where we are? A realm where we have fled. We have fled to a realm called Avernus, first of the nine hells. We are escaping a great evil. I guess Yankee. Uh, okay. We are going to the helm. Yep, we're going to the helm. In we go, little buddy. Goodbye, little buddy. 
<laughs> He'll find his way. Oh, yep. I didn't know you could go that way, actually. Cool. Ah, damn. Who's that? Oh. Yo, she's so cool. This is your end. Your head throbs and your skin tingles. Visions rush past. A dragon's wing, a silver sword, and a flash of your face seen through the strange woman's eyes. Oh. My head. What is this? Squall. You are no thrall. Blackith blesses me this day. Together, we might survive. What made you think I was a thrall? Okay. <laughs> We're turning into mind flares? There must be something we can do. We can do nothing until we escape. That must be our priority. Fair enough. First, we exterminate the imps. Then we find the helm and take control of the ship. As for that thing, it will remain tame as long as it believes we are thralls. It may be of use in the fight to come. <laughs> Just saying that out loud. Cool. Sup, bitches? Oh. Come at me, motherfucker. Okay, you're gonna go for this guy. Uh, claws. Get fucking shit on. Um, I'm gonna put you like over here, I guess. You can take a hit there. That's not what I meant to do. You go for him. Ayo. Good. I don't need that right now. I am fury. I am death. Damn. I can get right there. That works. Can I hit you from here? I can. Hey, good shit. First combat. Now we loot everyone. Traps, please. Got a sword there. Let's get back on our character here. Swift as my feet can carry me. Potion. Everyone's empty over there. I search those guys. For sure, for sure. Nobody even got hit, but I'm gonna hit this anyway, because it's fun. Um, so my AC, I know her armor is better than mine, so I'll switch that. And then I will give myself the crossbow. I think that's all I need right now. These are light weapons, so I can throw those if need be. This is also a light weapon. Oh no, I need the throne. Yeah, so just the hand axes. Let me put those aside. I can throw those if need be. And then I have the two javelins too that I can throw. That's fair. Take the small amount of gold that I can. Prying up these innards. 
touch the sphincter. Booty butthole. All right. Consoles. Oh, I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> I'm going to push button. Ionic energy radiates from the prisoners, but they do not react. Interesting. Well, okay. Didn't mean to do that. That works. Uh, I can hit him with this. Hey, perfect damage. Let's go. Uh, for all I know, there's no s way to save those guys. Hello? Okay, that works. Look for a latch. The construction is too alien. Nothing looks familiar. This ship is crashing. Do you intend to die for a stranger? The pod's stuck fast. I can't free you. I'll look around. There must be something to open this. So I know I'm supposed to do that, but... We're actually going to go in here because there's a key in here. How many hosts of these key infected? The dazed woman is trapped inside the pod. She doesn't notice you. Okay. Moving on. Treasure chest right here. Some potions in it. Cool. This guy has a rune. A bottle, two gold. But for what? And there's a button right here. Place your hand on the Put console. Your hand on the pod. You hear something. A presence connected to the pod, commanding the person inside to change. Oof. Krillin, preserve me. That cannot be our fate. The newborn mind flayer stares at you, weak and dazed. Cool. Wasn't there a dead guy around here somewhere? Ah. They have the key. The key to the chest to the thing in the butt. Let's go. So this chest right here. Just has some stuff to sell. Necklace. Cool. Now that we have the rune, we can save Shadowheart. The console appears dormant. There's a socket on the console shaped like the rune you found. Insert it. Uh, take a closer look. I have negative one to this. But I fucking nailed it. The pulsing glow and organic lines of the device make it seem more like a beating heart than a machine. This device is different from the one that caused the other captive to transform. Perhaps it will open the nearby pod. Place your hand on the console.
wisdom roll. Ah, oh, this is... I... Literally only could fail it with a one. You feel the biomechanical brain of the console process your command and yield to it. A shiver runs across your mind. You feel sated. Hey, oh. I am too big for this cutscene. You keep dangerous company. And you're racist. Dangerous company is what you need in a fight. Point. Looks like there's plenty of fighting ahead. Let me come with you. We can get off this ship and watch each other's backs along the way. All right, let's get going. I'm Xanros. What's that? It's nothing. Trust me. Enough of this chatter. We need to get to the helm. Now. She's right. Lead on. Cool. Second party member. Or third, really. Here we go. Don't really need that, but I like to hit it anyway. Even though there's another one right in here. Lamal. But we are nearing the helm. Once inside, do as I say. Who put you in charge? I'll trust my own judgment. Kane Yank. Okay. They clearly don't like each other. It's... Oh, I was like, I can't save the game. Here we go. So basically, two big guys are going to be fighting each other over there, which, holy shit, he has 150 health. Oh my god, I had no idea. Um, but basically, we got 15 turns to go hit that button. And not enough movement, but it doesn't matter. I don't have an action. Oh, I forgot to give her a... Ranged weapon. Oh well. Oh, and she sucks. Cool. Awesome. <laughs> but that guy has that big flaming sword. If we really, really wanted to, we could totally kill that guy to get that sword. But like I said, he's got 150 health. And he... Uh, Make way. he, you really need to hit him. Like, you need to roll good in order to get that sword. It's hard to get, but goddamn, is it worth it, honestly. But, I'm not gonna be metagaming. I don't know about the sword. <laughs> We're just gonna be progressing forward here. Ayo, get fucked. And then you can't really do anything, so I'm going to have you dash. Get all the way over here. No, stop right there. And then, oops, didn't mean to do that. Oh, 
I'll dash you too, since you're... Well, I might as well check out this Mind Flare with the Namethyst on it. That's cool. And Dagger. I'm sure there's some good stuff on these bodies. There's a ton of them. But... Oh well. So I'm gonna have you go here. I'm actually gonna shoot you in the face. That's fine. And then in my turn, you are gonna dash and get over with the others. That's fine. <laughs> So once we get about right here... Ah, or not. I'll have you dash then. Ah, he doesn't trigger the cutscene. That's cool. Well, let's go right here. Ah, there she goes. She triggered it. Check these bodies real quick. Nothing on them. Oh, you had a jewel. Uh, I'll have you dash. You can get right up in there. As much as you can, really. Mind flare missed. Yeah, there's no way we're going to be able to kill this guy. He's already at half health. So let's go here. And then let's shoot this guy. 85%, not bad. Hell yeah, got it. Swift and lethal. Uh, let's move you up. Can you hit these guys? You can. 85%, not bad. I'll take it. Didn't kill him. But that's okay. Now we can use him. This guy's gonna take a bit of a beating, but we shall see. Okay, sorry about that. Bit of an interruption. Uh, yeah, just gotta kill this dude. So I'm going to run this way. Might as well check this guy while I'm here. 65 isn't good, but hey, fucking slapped. Uh, that's the case. Then I will make you dash. Oh, you can almost get it. It should be the last turn, so. So you can't do anything, but you can get it. <laughs> oh no, nothing's loading in. Yeah, uh oh, where are all my textures? Those wooden spikes look real nice. <laughs> uh oh, where's the ship? Oh no, I'm T posing. 
Well, this is a good. <laughs> God, what a fucking start, dude. <laughs> You're fine, bro. <laughs> Landed feet first like a cat. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, I just took a nap. expected your memories to return once you were free of the mind flayer ship but your past is still an aching void if you don't find a way to remove the tadpole burrowed in your brain soon your future will be as blank as your past your head whispers vengeance you cannot wait to slice your way forth seeking whatever wrought this tragedy upon you <laughs> all right Tutorial finished. That's it. Very, very cool intro, except for that final scene. That was hilarious. But uh, I'm going to call it there. That's all for this episode. Next time, uh, we're going to be gathering up a party and hopefully breaking my oaths or <laughs> something. I'll see you in the next one.